Dan Plasma here with the champ, Nick Diaz. What's going on, Nick? Hey, I'm, I'm uh, it's whatever. I'm ready. Hey, you did a great job. Uh, you broke that guy's jaw. Did you have any idea that his jaw was broken during the fight? I, I knew I hit him with a hard shot. I didn't, you know. You know, I mean, his jaw's not broken, man. Come on, he's <laughs> trying to get sympathy. He's a tough guy. When was it that you decided to actually use your range and distancing and move around and own him with the boxing? Uh, I just decided, well, I already knew I had better boxing than this guy. I don't know, you know, I, I don't think I would have shot in and tried to take him down at all, except for that I was already in up on top, and I, I guess I forgot how I went there, you know, and I, I knocked him down, you know. I just, not that, I just you know, this is the mess out there, you know. What was it like getting cut by him again early in the fight? Uh, it, was, it was frustrating, you know, but... Um, I wasn't hurt by the cut, and it wasn't affecting me, so it wasn't, I just, right there, I just had to stand there and decide that, you know, it wasn't something that was going to bother me, you know, I knew they were going to stop it on the cut, so. Nick, one last question, I know you said that before the bout, you were really frustrated by the way that he celebrated last time, and he was so psyched that he had won after a doctor's stoppage, how much was that in your mind, how much was that pushing you for this win? If I had a one like that and this time and the doctor stopped it, I would have I would have got right on the microphone and told him that I'll fight him again. I didn't win this fight. I would have said, "Hey, the doctor stopped it." And uh, you know, I'm not going to accept a win like that. You know, "Oh, the doctor stopped it real quick on a little cut." I mean, if it's one thing if you're, you know, completely, you know, I, he's trying to play everywhere. I had